Turn it over. Go. Go. Daily comment. It says this right here. Facial regret. Did it did something that he said. Be honest with you, bro. Yeah, that nigga uncle's tripping. I ain't. I ain't gonna eat that shit. No way. Yeah, that shit, bro. It, I don't know what he was thinking. That is not pleasant. It's not enjoyable. And I don't see how any human being can eat around like 10 dry ass washcloth Popeye biscuits without ch without no water on a regular without choking. It's not possible, bro. I don't, I don't know not one person I could do at least like 15 biscuits in a row. He did like about like eight, seven. I think I did like seven in a row. No water. Then on top of that, I eat half a thing of wings too. Like ghost pepper wings on top of that. So it added a little kick of spice to it. So my thirst was getting clenched and clenched. Yeah. Never doing that again. I'll do something else. I do no water. But I ain't never doing the Popeye's biscuits again. Uh-uh. I'm cool. <laughs> Right about that one, little bro. This nigga killing the pancakes. This nigga sleep. I'm about to leave for a little bit. I'm about to go to the gym. Somebody about to take over for me. He knocked the fuck out. He up eating because he hungry. I don't know when he ate. I ain't even asked his parents. I just made him some uh, some pancakes. He about to eat that. Then he got some shit in his bag. He want to eat. Yes, sir. I know y'all hear all these cats with these weird addictions and shit. My weird addiction, bro, is it's not even a weird addiction. My addiction is going to the gym and working as hard as possible and helping my family. That's one thing I'm addicted to. You know what I'm saying? God. It's not like like if I don't do it, I'm gonna feel bad or anything like that. It's just that I know right from wrong. Like you, you, got, I'm at a certain age range. I know. Like, I know what's, what's right and what's wrong. You know what I'm saying? And I said, I told myself I don't want to be no drunk. I don't want to be no stoner. I don't want to be no bum. So only thing to do is win. You know what I'm saying? Only thing, only thing to do is left on that list is just become successful. And what can you do to be successful each and every day and working to yourself each and every day? Going to the gym. A gym is a good, a perfect example, bro. So that's the reason why I, that's how I became addicted to the gym. I was a fat loser just sitting in my room with the lights off. And I'm like, I don't want to live like this no more, bro. I don't want to live like this no more, bro. That one thing sparked me to becoming the hardest working man in the room. I don't care what you do or how you do it. Become the best at it. If you love it, why won't you do it passionately? You're not showing me you love it. It's showing me you just here for a check. I don't go to the gym for a check. So that's why I go in there and get the gym my all. I don't go in the gym expecting results as soon as I do something. I'm in there to learn and keep and keep pushing myself to be better at what I'm doing. My difference is I would rather learn a hundred times than to think I know something a hundred times. Feel me? I want to learn about the same subject a hundred different times. So I could get better at it twice that time. You feel me? So next time I come around doing this workout, I know. Next time I come around doing this type of video, I know how to edit it. I know where to put the markers at. I know where to put the, the eye-catching moments at. I know how to how to get people to subscribe. I know this applies to life, bro. I'm addicted to, to becoming a hustler. I'm a hustler, bro. I'm addicted to what I do. I'm addicted to YouTube. I'm addicted to working out. I'm addicted to being healthy. I'm addicted to bettering myself. I'm addicted to learning, bro. I'm a fucking addict at becoming the best person I can possible. That's only how I can explain it. And I'm not going to sit here and lie and say I'm, I'm perfect. I'm not far from fucking perfect, bro. I'm too real to a point that I, I'll tell somebody the real even though I know it might fuck up a relationship. You know what I'm saying? But love y'all, make sure y'all subscribe. I'm about to go to the gym. 
you gonna catch you gonna catch the advocate action, man. <laughs> I'm gone, man. I'm about to attempt the finale right here. Man. All the way, all the way. This machine can produce. I got it all on there. I'm about to attempt it. You listen to projects. Tell what I'm about. Keep quiet. Catch a nigga slipping from behind. OG, Bobby, Josh. OG, Bobby, Josh. OG, Bobby, Josh. OG, Bobby, Josh. Look at how quick I'm going to do it. Been in the sauna for a little minute now. Cooling, good workout. Definitely good. That's about to back from that Easter day, man. It's crazy Easter day. About to back from that. Pretty good workout. Continue drawing it. We'll catch y'all next clip. On it. Time to eat, time to eat. Got some little Chick fil A. Got some Grippos. These is my favorite chips of all time. Grippos, let me know what's your favorite chips in the comment right now. Go ahead. You know what I'm saying? Interact with me. Let me know what's your favorite chips in the comment. Let me know what's your favorite fast food in the comment. This is not my favorite fast food, but it's damn sure good. My favorite fast food is Biddy Bop. You put like Biddy Bop, Chipotle, shit like that. That's my favorite fast food if you was wondering. But yeah, chip for later today. Let's eat. Thanks to mom. Mom bought all this. I ain't buy shit. So I ain't gonna steal no hurt. I ain't gonna steal her credit. I'm a real one. Feel me? She bought all this shit. So I'm chilling right now, right? I'm doing. I'm doing a little thing to get this guideline, you know, active guideline strike off my thing, right? So it's a video I made about like four or five years ago about the truth of, you know, uh, the 2020 incident, right? So I ain't trying to get this video taken down. And I had recommend them to take zinc to get rid of their stuff. And they said, that's against the guideline. How is that against the guideline helping somebody? This is what I don't understand and what I'm so confused about. I'm not, I can't show y'all the screen because they're going to take this video down too. So you telling me there's no way that we can help or get somebody a little bit of knowledge about what to do and they should, they should just suffer, you know what I'm saying? Suffer through it. And it says, right here, it says, there is no, there's not a guaranteed prevention method for the 2020 incident. You're a thousand percent correct. It's not. But I'll write it for them to take zinc, to get it out their system, then just to sit there and just take it straight up and just die. Mind-blowing, mind-boggling to me, bro. Crazy. Oh. Uh.